When we press the Import button in the main window and expand the Sequence Type data field, the last option allows us to download sequences from the Internet. When we click Import, we are prompted to provide the accession numbers of the sequences of interest. I type here the accession numbers I wish to download. The separation character can be adjusted if necessary. You can choose to download the data from the EBI site, the NCBI site or the NIG site. When I click Next, I can see a preview of the sequences found. Double-clicking on a sequence opens the data in the Sequence Viewer window. Note that features and qualifiers will be imported as well. I click on Next and will start creating a new import template for this data format. Here you can see a list of the detected tags in the header field. The user can choose which header field he or she would like to import into a database information field in Bionumerics. I click on Accession and edit the destination of this field to use it as a key field in Bionumerics. And I would like the information listed under Source to be filled in in the source field of my Binomerics database. By clicking the preview button, I can check whether the fields have been assigned correctly. If so, I can close this window and click Next. As an entry link field, I will use the key, as this is a unique identifier for my entries. Pressing Finish prompts me for a name for the import template. I can choose a sequence experiment that is already present in my database, or I can create a new sequence experiment type in case it is the first time that I import sequences from this specific gene in this database. Here I assign the data to an existing sequence experiment. The overview shows that four new entries will be created. When I click the Finish button, the import will start. The new sequences are added to the database and the corresponding entries are selected. The content of the sequence viewer can be shown by clicking the colored dot. For alternative methods on sequence import and analysis, I invite you to view our other videos.